this play doesn't have many places to go. Ganking Fizz, as we saw, was nearly impossible because of Playful Trickster. Maybe he can counter gank here if he catches someone in turn aggro. Well, Chum the Waters is going to miss, but Dandy is already there. The teleport comes in. Whoa. Insect gets himself into this one, flashing over the right wall. Pawn's going to go down. Dandy's going to go down. Looper's just running around for chaos, but he might go down as well. Trying to get the kill on the corn before he gets out of this one, but he's holding Fisher. his breath. Doesn't have enough. The Lantern gets Looper out. Here comes the place of Fisher. Mata puts himself in front of the bullet and takes one for Looper. They're going to continue this fight a little bit as Imp comes in on this one. They're going to chase out Royal Club, but they don't have enough to continue the fight. Well, Cola could easily be on the backside of those plays for Royal Club now 2-0 and zero with that Rod of Ages already charging over Looper, who's still trying to farm up his second time for this pink ward here. He doesn't know what's around him. There's not enough early wards for White as usual, and this could be Looper going down. Now it's Korn getting the rotation first. Now it's Royal Club doing what they need to do. 13 minutes in there, 3-1 to the 2-2.4 two thousand gold lead. Yeah, that was another good gank there, but mainly for the first time all series, Korn beats Pawn to a spot. He was able to push up the mid lane, move away from it, and 3v1 Looper, which is what they needed to take down a Singe, but they do that all without losing turret damage, without losing an objective, and without really losing CS in the lane. A play that Samsung White did not counter is tremendous. Really ganking any of these lanes is really difficult for Ramis, as we've seen. It's a wonder he's 0-0-3 because of the counter gank. You think the Twitch Thresh, they can either stealth or Thresh Lantern away. Singed is so incredibly hard to tank down, you need three people. And Fizz can just playful tricks away from the power ball. Yet still, he's been able to pull off a few things. Cola goes in strong. Insect stopped on a minion. Twisted advance and the Vengeful Maelstrom is down, so they're mitigating a bit of that damage that Cola's taking. Looper comes in with his teleport. They try to turn this around. Dandy comes in to help take down. That's going to be Cola. He gets shut down gold there. Pawn's not done in the mid lane either. Oh, a no. beautiful blast. What about the turret? He's going to go down. Nobody gets that blue buff, but beautiful play by Korn to make it a one for one in the mid lane. One thing I said just moments ago that vision important and I saw Royal Club just moments ago pinging inside their own jungle back pings as well saying don't go in there we've got no vision don't yeah. get caught out at this stage Pornia actually gonna dive towards the zero, zero. Have they out. got the damage to kill him off the fish is already in there's the ultimate of Pawn gonna go low last second Sonya's oh, here comes the clean up team he's gonna oh let it go God. the flash over for Uzi will get it he's gonna go towards him double kill Uzi. team down for Uzi can he get it anymore it's Looper that's the next focus and that one will fall over to Cola four men are down they wow. try Baron yeah, this is smart, but at the same time, it's a way of accelerating the game a little bit. They want to retake both of these inhibitors so the Baron control is easier. That means that Samsung White wants to find the fight right now. This is their window. Inhibitor is going to be going down. Pawn waiting off to the side. Dandy coming in close. Uzi going to go for it. He's trying to get caught in the back. Uzi, though, is left alone on the back side. They need to keep him in check. Zero goes low. Insect at half HP. They still have Pawn dancing around in this one. That's two kills over to Samsung. Why is fine? Uzi is still there. There is Uzi to get the double. Will jump away to stay alive. Can he get more? He's no win. He's in the poison, but he's got the life. Oh, no. He does finally go down for Looper. Will die as well. And that is the ace. Is that the game for Royal Club? They have a two inhibitor advantage. 40 second death timers on Samsung White. It looks like this is going to game four. Corn and Cola still alive, doing what they can in these Nexus turrets. The next minion wave coming in. Royal Club can keep themselves alive in this series here with one more take. A siege wave coming in from the top. It's going to be closest 19 seconds. That's him. There's no chance that he's going to nope. be up before that Nexus goes down. 38-18, they start on the Nexus, and Royal Club do the impossible. They take game three against White, and we're going to be going to game four. The 